Okay, you want me to answer the questions on this? Mm -hmm. Okay, well, my name is Dan Ewald, and I graduated from Purdue with a bachelor's in 1956 and a master's in 1968. And I student taught under, nobody will know, but under Ernie Blair at Hamlet High School in Stark County. And I don't know who influenced me to enter ag education. The school I went to didn't have vocational ag, and so I could barely spell it when I started this school, but, but uh, I suppose the high school principal uh, kind of steered me into ag education. He and my parents, I'd always been active, in, or been active in 4-H, and, and uh, we lived on, a, or lived on a farm, and I still do live on the same farm. And that was that was my influence. Uh, the people here that kind of kept me on the track and, and and encouraged me to keep going was probably Dean Fendler. And when I got into Arlen Brown's classes, he was a positive influence. I don't know, as far as number five, um, decision making and getting along with people. And, uh, whatever leadership skills I may have, I was president of Indiana Vocational Ag Teachers Association. It has a different name now, but it was, that's what it was then. And after I retired from teaching, I was president of Indiana Beef Cattle Association. And as far as young people starting out, uh, when I first saw that, I said don't. <laughs> but I would advise them to, to usually to not go back to their home school to teach, to start out at least, and not to change schools very often. I taught in the same school for my whole career, 34 years. Um, when, when I was in the early years that I taught, they had what they called itinerant teacher trainers. And the one that was in District 1 where I student taught and taught all the time was I.G. Morrison. And after I'd been there a couple years, a few years, the principal told me, he said I wouldn't stay there, that I'd move on to a bigger school, better school, whatever. And I fooled him. <laughs> but it was a good situation. And during, the, during the time that I taught, I enjoyed about 99% of the experiences, I suppose. And what else do you want to know? That's probably good, unless you have any other comments. No, I don't believe so. Okay. I'm, I'm, most of the benefits I believe you get from college and from Purdue are not in the classroom. They're from mm -hmm. associations and people you become acquainted with and things you learn about life. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Well, thank you.